here is my baby's brew. It came in this box right here. And inside of the box, it also came with the wire so that you can plug in to charge it. So on the back of your bottle warmer, you can just open this up. You can place your wire right into the back. And now this bottle warmer doesn't come with a block to plug it in, but I'm just gonna be using the one from my phone. And you can plug it right into a charging block and then you can plug this right into the wall. Now this little top silicone piece with the little bunny ears, you could just push it in and pull it up. So here's what the stainless steel plate looks like in the inside. It also comes with the silicone piece that has to be in there at all times when you're using this bottle warmer. Now on the bottom of your bottle warmer, you're going to notice an on and an off button. If you press this button once, it's gonna make a beeping noise and it's gonna show you how charged your bottle warmer is. Now this bottle warmer does have four different adjustable settings. So if you hold this button down for two seconds, it's gonna kick you into the first adjustable temperature setting, which is 80 degrees Fahrenheit. It kicks you into 80. In order to get to your second temperature setting, you would click it again, and it would get you to 98. Your third would get you to 103, and your fourth would get you to 110. And when you're all done, you can hold it for two seconds, and it will turn your bottle warmer off. And when you're all done, place this circle on the top of the bottle warmer, and now it's perfectly suctioned. However, I wouldn't recommend carrying your bottle warmer around like that. So the nice thing about this bottle warmer is that it does fit a lot of wide neck bottles without needing an adapter piece. So something like the Avent bottle fits this portable bottle warmer perfectly. So you wouldn't even need an adapter piece. So always when heating up your milk, you want to flip your baby's brew upside down and screw it onto the bottle. Because if you have your fluids in here and you flip the bottle over, then you're gonna spill your milk. Now you can flip it upside down. Now, if you are using a bottle that doesn't fit your baby's brew, you're going to want to order the adapter that's gonna fit your bottle. So here's the box of the bottle warmer adapter that I am using, and I'm using it for my Como Tomo bottle. And something that's really nice about this is that it's gonna tell you which kind of bottles that it fits. So in this box right here, this is the adapter that comes with it. So with my Como Tomo bottles, I can just screw this adapter piece on. And when I'm ready to heat up my baby's bottle, I would do the same thing where I flip my bottle upside down and I screw it right on. So I hope that you guys all enjoyed today's video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already checked out my video on the Baby's Brew bottle warmer where I go over some of the pros and cons, you guys can find that right on my channel. As always, I hope that you all have a blessed day and a blessed week, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!